Thank you for coming by my site, Tori Magoo 44. I'm just about ready to head out to a play. I'll show you my outfit. My This is my nifty thing that I got at the gift show. I'm not sure if you can really see it, but it has all these really cool dangly things. And it's just, it's very, very fun. But I'm going to talk to you tonight about something that is not fun. And that is the Church of Scientology's Narconon Death Trap. It's a very important thing that you guys pass this link around, pass around. I'm going to put a link in here to the gentleman who spoke last night on um, Rock Center with Brian Williams. But it's really, really important that we get this information out because people do get suckered in by the Church of Scientology. It isn't connected to it, which is what he says, the journalist says. It's run by the Church of Scientology. Narconon, the Church of Scientology is like an umbrella. Narconon is definitely one of their parts underneath it. it they, I worked at Narconon International, which I've told you guys before, but they write all their statistics every Thursday before too, go straight up to the Church of Scientology International, and they are counted. So they are part of the Church of Scientology, even though they say they're not. But as one of my friends told me when I left, how can you tell if a Scientologist is lying? I said, I don't know how. And they said, if their lips are moving. And it's it, as sad as that is, it's kind of close to the truth because they there's so many things that Scientologists don't know about, won't look at, won't hear, won't find out about, so they're kind of spouting things that they're sure they're making up when really someone else fed it to them and it's out the other way. That's the way it goes. So including how happy they are. I'm happy to be at Narconon and then their parents find out they're dead. I mean, how awful is that? There were three people within, I think, a nine month period last year that died that were went to Narconon. I mean, I mean, you can hear their parents speak about it. It's awful. I mean, it, it, so please, that's all I'm asking you today is please pass around this link and this link so that I'm putting in the comments about the show so that less and less people go there and get harmed by the Church of Scientology's Narconon non-drug rehabilitation center. It really, it, it couldn't be, it, it's a mess and you'll hear it. And this is from the president of Narconon. He used to be the president. Okay, so I got to run. I'm going to my play. I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. I love you. Bye-bye.